Hello, everyone. Hello. Welcome to Piccadilly Stampin'. I'm Pamela Pick, and this is my husband, Bill Pick. Hello, hello, hello. He is going to be doing the demonstration tonight. So I guess. That's what I've been told. <laughs> He's offered, or uh, did we rope you into it, or what? <laughs> Let I've me been get told. The, you've been told? I you just told. listen to what you've been told? Let me check out on the laptop here. Well, Jean made it from North Dakota. How many inches did you get, Jean? She was supposed to get all that snow, you know. Yeah, she showed a picture of it. So, yeah. All I saw was her deck. Hi, France. Hi, Jackie. Hi, Laura. Thank you, Jean, for sharing. I can't get it to come up. Hi, Miriam. So, come on in. You can't get it to do what? It's not coming up. There we are. Okay. I got it, finally. Hi, Lori. Hi, Jean Norwig. Hi, Mary Jo. Uh... We got we got a crowd, so everyone's here to see you. So everybody's here to see me make a fool of myself. Huh? Oh, you're not gonna make a fool of yourself. It's I picked something very easy and very cute. I'll walk you through every step. So these cards are the cards that I made last week, and um, we will be uh, doing a drawing tonight to get these um, as giveaways later on at the end. Uh, Izzy's drawing that, right? No, I'm going to draw tonight since you're doing the, uh -huh, yeah, I'm taking that job away. So, um, share that video and then you can get into next week's drawing for Bill's card. Woohoo! <laughs> Let's do quick announcements. Ooh, those are in there. Uh, sign up for my newsletter. I don't send them. I know some people send them all the time. I send them when there's something that you need to know. They're not sent... Um, you know, I, I'm not even going to guarantee every week and some weeks there's going to be more than others, but, um, sign up and it'll give you the company information and stuff from Piccadilly Stampin'. Best way to sign up is right here on Facebook, but if you're on a mobile device, you're definitely going to want to go to a computer and sign up that way, or you would want to go to piccadillystampin.blogspot.com and there's a sign up form. We still have last chance products. We've sold out of a bunch of them. There was a whole lot when this thing started, but we have a bunch of last chance products available. And um, yeah, the sooner you shop, the better. You, it, Get it while it's low. While, while it's there's, hot. yeah, um, the better selection, because I know some things have really sold out. Um, celebrating in colors. Okay, this is new. We'll just have this be the last one. Um, I'm kind of excited about this, you guys. That's a so, paper pumpkin. Yes, but they're doing something different with paper pumpkin. So those of you who don't know and are new to us right now, paper pumpkin is a box subscription that comes each month in your mail. It fits right in your mailbox. This one is going to be 10 cards, five each, or no, 10 cards, two each of five designs, plus coordinating envelopes, and it's going to be featuring the in colors. Ooh. So it looks pretty good. It says that this one, Vivid Pops of Colors, da, 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 da. I was going to look if there was any kind of theme that they gave us. It says, send joy and excitement to friends, family, and coworkers, or anyone that makes your life happy. But they have this golden voucher. So it says... Um, every May Paper Pumpkin subscriber will get a chance to win a golden voucher worth $25 up in Stampin' Up! products. So the winners, that's with an S, so there's more than one, will find their golden voucher in their May 2022 Paper Pumpkin box. Good luck. Well, I mean, that's a little bit more than what a Paper Pumpkin subscription. I'm going to take a risk on that. What do you think? Sounds good. Yeah. Plus, it's got these in colors, which I, apparently I stuffed these in there. So I might as well show you if you're new. We've got some new in colors. Here is the reds that we currently have. The new one that's coming is called Sweet Sorbet, and it's this color. So you can kind of see the differences of it. It's, it's like a lighter version of the Poppy Parade. I love it. And... While I'm at that, I might as well show you the green because I just bet you anything. I'm going to bet. I'm, a, I'm in a betting mood right now. I have a feeling that these will probably be the Christmas colors this year. What do you think? 
so this is the uh, other mm -hmm. new one. This is Parakeet Party. Yeah, possibly, Bill says. I bet you. You want to make a bet? No. Because <laughs> you know. <laughs> yeah. And here are other greens. And the closest one to it is Granny Apple Green. But it makes Granny Apple Green, which I've always thought is very bright. It makes it actually kind of look... Dull. Uh, well, I wouldn't say dull, because I definitely yeah. like Granny Apple yeah. Green. But it's just not as like bright. This one reminds me of Lemon Lime Twist, if you know that one from a few years back. And then we got three blues this time, and they're awesome. So let me pull these out. The current blue that we had was this Pacific Point, the Balmy Blue, and then the Knight of Navy. And that's kind of our selection of blues. We just had those three. So this is really nice because the Tahitian Tide is very much a teal, um, almost a, it's not quite aqua enough to be like a turquoise, but it's definitely a good kind of medium blue, little tealish. And then the other two is Starry Sky and Orchid Oasis. And so they have a little bit more of a purple feel to them. So very, very pretty colors. So I'm excited about these coming out and that is going to be with um, in the the next month's Paper Pumpkin, the May Paper Pumpkin. They'll be featuring those colors. So bright and fun. Okay, you guys. <clears throat> Let's get started. So I'm going to I'm going to um remind you guys to use this host code when you're ordering and to share this video to your wall and your name will be put in a drawing. Be sure to mark that you share. You can head on in there, Bill. Okay. And Bill's moving into place. Woohoo! Hello. So I How come you don't show up? There you are. There you okay. are. It just is on its way. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> All right, so I have made it my goal to just, I'm going to start off. Why don't you tell them what this is? Oh, this is a Taylor Tag Punch. And what is that Taylor Tag Punch? It's going out. It is. And and yeah, who's better, sad about it? You are very so, sad, sad, sad. Yeah, I'm very sad. So I'm going to have him use that. Yep. I'm also sad about this bundle. Why don't you tell them about the bundle? Bundle so, is... Uh, it, in symmetry. In symmetry with the symmetry stems or sentimental stems. Yeah. <laughs> so, <laughs> and then um, if they purchase those together, they get a discount. A 10% discount. That's right. Mm -hmm. So we're going to be using both of those too. Yep. And on top of it, why don't you tell them about this, what we're going to be using. We'll be using this, uh, this is Sweet our... Symmetry Designer Series Paper. Sweet Cemetery Designer Series yep. paper, yep. And it's kind of cool. Yeah, I think it we're is. using this page. Yep, pull it out because you'll be using that page. This page right here. Yeah. All right. And you can put that on the other side then. Okay, so I'm just going to walk you through this as, as we go, okay? Okay. Why don't you take that tailored tag punch, and I want you to just cut out, uh, punch out, I guess, five of these. Five of these, huh? Yes. There you go. Okay, now why don't you flip it this side? I was. Okay, I didn't know. <laughs> and... Oops. There you go. Go, go down a little bit. Yeah, there you go. Good. And then I want it to go the same direction, so here's what I do, is I just do this. You need one more. And when she said, just do this, she tears off the edge. Yeah. I was telling him, I guess. So. I just need one more, right? Yep, just one more. All right. Hey, Bill, um, people are, then that can go right there. Yep. So that was the Taylor Tag Punch, and he's got five of them cut out. All right. People are wondering if you're going to tell dad jokes tonight. Oh, no dad jokes tonight. But, uh, you know, most people are shocked that I'm not a, not a very good electrician. <laughs> Did they hear that? Let me I don't see know. if they heard that, because you were kind of quiet. 
it came off. He said no dad jokes, but then he said, say it again. Well, most people are shocked that I'm not a very good electrician. That's a dad joke. <laughs> That's a horrible dad <laughs> joke. Okay, this is Misty Moonlight, which is another one of Ooh, our retiring Misty colors. Moonlight. And why don't you go ahead and make a card base out of that? Okay. How did I teach you? Up uh, through the center. If it's not perfect, we're going to... Shoot me. <laughs> Down and across. And then I take the bone folder and Love. move it across just like this. Yes. Okay. So there's my base. Okay. Now, I'm going to give you that. It's just a scratch piece. Can you open up this? Oh, I hope so. That is the Knight of Navy... Maybe. I know. It's like a compact. There you go. And then you turn it in. Knight of Navy. Knight of Navy. And why don't you show them this thanks oh. so much on that stamp set? Because that's this. Which one? Thanks this so one? much. This is what I'm using. Yep. Okay. okay. Right here. Thanks so much. And. I want you to Do just... I need a scrap paper? Not, no. Because mm. you're going to be using the punch to punch it out. So no, you won't need scrap paper. I'm going to get some of this punching done first so we can get stuff out of your way. Make sure it's lined up. Hold and release. Did it come out good? No. So there's two sides of a paper, and I want you to do it in the middle of that paper because you're going to have to punch that out. So flip it over. Oh, up here? Mm -hmm. or... Do it in the middle. Here? Just the middle on the side. You're going to okay. use the Taylor Tag Punch to punch it out. So ink it up. Tap, tap, tap three times. You don't... There you go. And you're going to have to put a little pressure on it in the center. Don't rock. That any better? Oh, yeah. Much better. Much better. Okay. And then you can put the ink up. And then I want you to grab that tailored tag punch again. Flip it the other way. There you go. And I want you to punch that out. Should have left this out. Well, I wanted it out of your way. I'm trying to get this stuff out of your <laughs> way. So you kind of center it on there. Can you go up a little higher on the yeah, camera? Like here? Yeah. So just center it in there. And punch that out. Good job. See, even new punchers, or new punchers, new stampers can do this. Okay, now this is Smoky Slate, and it's a scrap piece. Smoky Slate. Now, I want you to open up that other punch, the symmetrical stems. Okay. Okay, now do you know how to use this one? Well, I think it slides in this way. Yes, put it all the way in. All the way back put to the little down. lip. The little lip right here so that it's yep and then press down and then press down right here yep press down give it a good press now pull it up and you should have two little stems two stems so all now right you can put so that that goes right beside you over there yep down below okay okay so now we got the punching going all now, my parts can you get out oh, do you know where remember they use the host code and and why do they use the host code because if they order 150, 150 or less, they get a. Then they I they like, get they get their prize money. No. No. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, well, I don't. I'll remember. explain it. Using the host code helps me out, and I really would appreciate it if you would use them. Um, oh, when, they get theirs right. over 150. If it's a, over 150, don't do it because then you get the host code. Yep. Okay, do you know where I keep my stamp and trimmer? It's right here. Okay, well, let me move some stuff out of your way. And you put that... Out. And you're going to need to go clear up kind of at the top yep. so it's in camera. And I'm going to have to turn it around. Uh, yeah, because this comes yep, out this yep. way. But we don't need that, so okay. don't worry about that. So open it up. I want you to trim four inches. Show them how you can do four inches. Okay, measure twice, trim once. One. 
Go right up to that line. I am, but I was okay. making sure I was up against the top. Okay. Yeah. So it's square. And then. Wait, you're a little high. I didn't realize you were that high. <laughs> okay. There we go. There we go. Still on there? Yep. So I okay. need to, this one. That one is, so show them, get it in camera. They yeah. can't see. It has a little circle there to score. That's the score one. Yep, yeah, but you just want to run the dark one. The dark one has a little triangle on it, I'm feeling. And then and you just... Yep. Okay, now pull out the scrap piece first. Hand that to me. Now okay. turn that card and go to, um, let's see, four by five and a half. So you want it clear over... No, by five and a quarter, sorry. Let's see. Right there. To that right that's or, five and a half no five and a half that's only a quarter here right, right there go right to there you're doing five and an eighth yeah there you go five and a half oh okay okay or five and a quarter i mean sorry this would be five and a half that's oh, okay. a quarter okay five gotcha. and a quarter. okay okay doesn't have a diamond on it or anything like that so okay like a tape measure that i would use or oh something. yeah mm -hmm. you're used to using yeah. tape measures okay well that's okay. fine go ahead and then cut trim off that excess now this trimmer is my favorite trimmer in the planet open it up and then that you can just throw into the trash there you go okay that pull that aside i'm okay. going to give you one more while you're there one more while so here. we're going to do an eighth inch border so for that, then you need three and seven eighths. So if you got four here, it's going to be, yeah, that one. Because we're just going to do a little three and seven eighths inch. And this is Misty Moon, or this is Night of Navy. Sorry, this cardstock. The other one was basic white. So then we're going to need five and an eighth. So instead of this was the quarter, yeah, that's it. I knew you were a smart one. He did his trimming on camera. He was kind of worried. Yeah, I was. I was nervous. Yeah. Didn't want to break it. You didn't break it. I'm trying to tell. The reason I use you for this is so that if there's any kind of a, now you can put that away, any kind of a new stamper out there, they can see. That's pretty easy. Yeah. They can see how easy it is if I can it was. show you how to do this. So we're going to take this mis this uh, Knight of Navy piece, uh -huh. and it was cut at three and seven eighths right. by five and an eighth. Right. And what I want you to do... Oh, I get to lay these out? Yep. And how... Yeah. Now can you lay two kind of like that? Yep. Just now, the big them... thing is, is remembering to get equal borders in yeah. there. And then I want you to take the liquid glue and don't over glue, but I want you to take the liquid glue and kind of around the center in just a little bit, I want you to put that so that you can glue those down on that Knight of Navy piece. I figure if I can show my husband how to stamp and create, anybody. Do I have to turn that? No. Just, there you go. Yep, that's perfect. Oh, okay. There you go. Efficient. Anybody can stamp. I have so many people that say, I can't do that. I'm not crafty. Oh. So kind of, yeah, you got it. You put that really good because that's about the right border see in that and then just have that one with the same kind of length in between and the the reason why I use the green uh, Tombow multi-purpose glue is it gives it a minute to kind of move around you got that where you like it I hope so okay now the next thing I want you to do another one but I want you to put it right like this so whatever borders there yeah you got it okay. you understand it's amazing you're doing an amazing job i can't see what everyone's saying let me stop a minute angie shared hi angie oh levi's on hi levi <laughs> <laughs> um nick is on gene jackie karen they're saying yay bill that means gracie's watching you that's too. right Oh, did you get a little glue? little glue. Okay, yeah. it's okay. I can show I you how to a, fix it. I had to move it. It's okay. I okay, can... so I got it lined up there. I want you to do the same thing, a little uh, less glue. Go down here. 
on each end like that but don't I would kind of glue this and then put it down because you don't want to have glue on the outside edge or you will um, get it all over your table on project look at you go oh you're killing it I'm telling you so what's really fun is when Bill's in my uh, craft room and working on projects do it on there yeah Working on projects with me, I love it when we do Christmas cards together. That's probably my favorite. Um, but he takes me out to a shop, and I've actually learned how to use power tools. There, see how that green glue kind of gets yeah. that, and you've got the same border? Yeah, I like that. Do you like it? Okay, mm -hmm. it's looking good. Now, I want you to grab these snips, and I know that they're a little foofy for you with all that ribbon. You know exactly what to do. Here's your trash can that you can... So he's just trimming it. These are the scissors I never get to use. He has to have special permission to use these, I'll be honest. Okay, here you go. But I don't go out and use your power tools either, so mm -hmm. let's let's yeah, uh, we're... let's be fair on this, okay? Yep. All right, look at him go. So ladies. I know very much that I am married to a wonderful guy that he would even get on camera and do this. Now, you got that done. It's looking fantastic. Can you mat that right onto that 1 8 inch? So it's going to be a little bit of a um, tight squeeze, but try to get it in that area. Look at him. I've got him trained on those small beads of glue. It's just like your woodworking, right? Yep. So, awesome. And get it on there, and then that'll give you a little minute, uh, minute to kind of move it around. Like I was saying, if I can get my husband to stamp a card with me, pick it up if you need to to move it so that you can see off of that. Yeah, there you go. With his big Hulk hands, anybody can do this. Now, can you take that, get it where you want it? It's there now. <laughs> Got to kind of commit to, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. Will you take that and now put that onto the card base for me? Just adhere it on with that glue. Mm -hmm. There's Kathy Walton. Mary Ellen says, good job, Bill. Uh, Lori's, oh, Janet's on. Hi, Janet. Janet says you're doing good. Yeah. You're doing I'm great. glad she got to join us from California. Yeah. We had snow today, you guys. I mean, not like what you had, Jean. Yeah. I know you had to have. Jean quite a had few. twenty inches, is what she was saying. Twenty inches. Yeah. Whoa! You keep it. You keep it right up north there. Mm -hmm. So get that centered on the way you like. Yep. Okay. So do you know where I keep my dimensionals? Right here. Yep. Okay. I want you to take on the back side of the sentiment. And I want you to put two. Oh, I want you to listen here real quick. I want you to put two, but I don't want them right up to the edge. You want them just kind of in the middle? Kind of right here, yes. And the reason why is because I'm going to have you use glue dots. And, okay, you got that? For as big a hands as he has... <laughs> There you go. Now, kind of put, oh, yeah, I love that placement. Put it like that. That's great. He knows, he knows what I like. I like it kind of on that lower right-hand side. Beautiful. Now, what I want you to do, put these up and grab, do you know where I keep my glue dots? Right here. Yes. Do I get to use the fancy thing? You can, but you don't need that for this. But you can, you'll can you use it for the next step. Okay. okay. <laughs> so this one, how do you remember how I train on glue dots? Get your hands up higher so that they can see. You roll you, them. Yeah, but you need to go, why don't you turn that facing you? Turn that, yeah. Pull that down. There you go. Okay. I want you to take one of these. Now here's what I want you to do. Wait, wait, before you get too excited. I want you to lay these kind of coming out here like so okay okay whatever looks good to you that way but so then don't put, I have to roll that no not on this okay. you only have to roll it if it's really little so you I'm look at he's no 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 no. go yeah there we go and then you're gonna stick that underneath because I want it to be able to 
Oh, there you go. I know that's really tiny for you, but you're doing great. So stick it under there how you like, where there's going to be two. Somebody gets to win Bill's card next week. Yep, share it. Share, share the video it. to your wall, and your name will go into the drawing, and you'll get a Bill's original. Okay, same thing there. I know this is so tiny for you. <laughs> you're not used to it, but you're doing fantastic. I, you're getting hearts like crazy. Um, Jean says her snow totals might be higher. Oh. Yeah. So... Well, we had a little bit of snow flurry, but there you go. It's it's gorgeous. Now, because Bill was making the card, I didn't want a bunch of bows and stuff. So on this... I get to use the new picking tool? It's called Take Your Pick Tool. Take Your Pick Tool. Okay. And I would say on this, for a little glitz, let's take some of these rhinestones. They're adhesive backed. And then place maybe two up on top and then one on the bottom like up here and yeah. one over here yeah wherever you see so. so come at put that down on the table and come at an yeah an angle like that that might be easier with there you go get that stuck <laughs> he's a natural i'm super proud super proud there you go and then one down here yeah, here or even here if you want and have a little bit more of a well you had that one just kind of hanging you didn't get it placed on it look at you you're resourceful you're resourceful. Well, it's upside down jackie said it was 80 degrees in pittsburgh today well it was 80 degrees here yesterday go bill go <laughs> <laughs> okay there Big we go fox says go bill okay so 80 degrees huh yeah it was so what hot are you you're looking for a hot day Am I looking? To, are you going to take me on a hot day? Uh, just pick a day in August. It can't get any hotter. Oh, my God. Another dad joke. I'm serious, you yep, guys. Yep, there you go. So, <laughs> you want to let me so in So, how there. do I get that rid of that? Oh, well, if you get a little smutz, like that word, take the other one. Yep. Now, you can go in there with that little, you have to kind of press, yeah. And then you can, let me show you real quick, because you got to kind of get... I usually cut a little piece on the end, and you got to get a little aggressive with it. Oh, okay. You know, take out your frustrations that your wife didn't cook tonight. Oh. Okay, there you go. It's gorgeous. There you I go. love it. Way to go. Oh, well. You're awesome. You Make sure you use that host code. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Thank you, honey. <laughs> Isn't he wonderful? I, he's so good. So I made two of these because next week we'll do a drawing for um, Bill's card. And I thought this was good. There's no bows. There's no foo-foo on it. I didn't want him to have to do a foo-foo <laughs> card. Me trying to tie a bow. <laughs> but, these, these hooks. so that'll be for next week's drawing. For this week's drawing, we already had some. Oh, you know what? I moved into the position. I guess I'll so, be doing the drawing. This is everybody who shared. Thank you so much. I got all your tickets in here. I'm going to shake it up. You're going to do the drawing, I guess. Yep. All right. Draw two. Okay. Give me the names. Madison Craft. All right, Maddie. I know where you live, so I will definitely get that to you. And Lori Fox Manch. Manch. Manchu. 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 Manichu, Manichu? Manichu? Sorry, Lori. Um, since I don't have your address, will you send that to me? Just message me here on Facebook, and I will get this card off to you. So, you guys, thank you so much for supporting me in my business. Share the video. Your name will go in the drawing for next week's cards. Use this host code if your order is under $149.99. Anything else, Bill? Like us on YouTube. Yeah. Um, Follow us on YouTube. And thanks for allowing us to come and entertain you for a little bit. Have a great evening. We will see you next week here at 7 p.m. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.